Hey everyone, it's mom of two, wife of one, and it's Friday night, so that means it's time for... Movies with Mommy and Me. And tonight we watched The Son of Bigfoot, which is on Amazon Prime. That's right. And the movie is about a little boy, well it doesn't start this way, but basically it's about a little boy who lives with his mom, he's 12 years old, and he just can't fit in at school, he's being bullied, he has this really long hair... And he discovers after his mom cuts his hair that it grows back instantly. And he discovers that his feet kind of grow for no reason to grow out of his shoes. And basically he discovers that his father, who he thought wasn't alive all this time, is alive and well and is actually Bigfoot living in the forest. He discovers all these powers he didn't have, like super speed, no ladybug, like super speed and super hearing and just a bunch of other stuff. So it just follows the story of him reuniting with his dad and then a company called Hairco that makes toupees that is on the hunt for his dad to try to use his DNA to revolutionize hair growth. So it was a pretty interesting movie. What did you think about it? Well, there were a few moments that I did not like, but also some I liked. Okay, and so my we... rating out of wait, wait, five... Wait, 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 not yet. What moments did you like in the movie? Well, moments that oh. I like, probably like the battle between the animals and the People of uh, Heron Co., I think. Okay, and what didn't you like? And what didn't I like? Well, not well, okay. not all the parts of the fight I liked. Like some where where he thought I heard you, lady. Where they thought he was dead, and. That part I didn't really like. And when they started interrogating them and all that, that stuff I did not like. I definitely thought it was a cute movie. It was a different premise. Um, I'm not one of those people that like reads The Inquirer and reads all about Bigfoot. I never really cared about it. And I'm sure there have been probably movies made about it. But I thought it was cute. It was a cute little animated piece. It wasn't that long. And I thought it was just a nice family movie. So... Yeah, think, rating it, what would you rate it? Yeah, I think it's also a nice family movie. And my rating has changed when I watched it. At first, I was like, oh, man, this is bad. And then I was like, wow, this is getting better. And then I was like, okay, this is starting to get worse. So I give it, like, a 3 out of 5. I was going to say the same thing. I'll give it a 3 out of 5. It wasn't bad at all. I feel like... If you ask me a week from now what the movie was about, I may not necessarily remember. But, I mean, it was something to do. And it wasn't, it was, it was fine. It was an okay movie. Not too long. Wasn't boring. I think it had a couple parts where, that were a little dry. But I thought it was okay. For younger kids, uh, maybe hard to hold their attention. I feel like some of the themes in there were a little more adult for younger children. Like, it didn't have but that many songs in it. It didn't have that many songs at all, but it also had... Like, the the villain was this person who was just kind of money-hungry and basically was resorting to kidnapping people. So, some of the things I thought, again, were a little mature, but not so mature that my soon-to-be 12-year-old couldn't watch it. And my 6-year-old sat and watched it, but I know she definitely didn't understand everything that was happening. But, yeah, so overall, we give it 3 out of 5 family trees. And we'll be back next week with the new... Actually, no, we won't be back next week because you'll be at your grandparents' house. Oh, yeah, so we'll be doing it on Thursday. Either we'll do it Thursday or we'll wait until the week after that to do it. But thank you guys for tuning in. And let us know if you go to see The Son of Bigfoot. Let us know your thoughts on it. Give us your own rating. And feel free to recommend some movies to us if you find anything on... Amazon Prime or Netflix or maybe even YouTube. Or Disney+. Plus. We have all those. We don't have Hulu. So if you recommend something for that, we won't be able to watch it. But anything else, definitely recommend it. We love watching movies together. And, yeah, that's pretty much it. So thank you guys. We'll see you next week. Peace. Peace.